Hey everyone, it's Sarah Threadster Nurse RN.com and in this video I'm going to go over how to clean dentures as a nurse. So as a nurse you're going to be providing care to patients who wear dentures and your role will include helping the patient take those dentures out, cleaning the dentures, and providing mouth care because a lot of times patients are really sick and they can't get out of bed and do this like they normally would at home. So you'll help them at night with doing that because they don't sleep with the dentures at night and you'll help them in between the meals after they eat. And some things you want to keep in mind whenever you are taking care of dentures is that you don't damage them because they're very expensive and they don't become lost because you have a lot of people going in and out of the patient's room, the patient's sick, they're not really keeping track of where their dentures are. So you'll, as a nurse, you'll wanna keep them secured. So first what you wanna do is you want to gather your supplies, which will include a denture cup, which you'll want to put a patient label on the denture cup, on the lid, or write the patient's name, the room number, so they don't get confused with any other person's dentures. Also, a soft bristle toothbrush, with cleaning paste for the dentures. It's really recommended that you use a denture cleaning paste instead of toothpaste because that can be abrasive to the dentures. A kidney basin, towels, paper towels, and gloves. And also be sure that you ask the patient if they brought any of their denture cleaning supplies because some patients may prefer that you use their supplies. Then you'll want to perform hand hygiene and don gloves and then assist the patient with removing their dentures. So our patients remove their dentures and we've put them in the denture cup with the lid on it and we've doffed our gloves and performed hand hygiene. And now we're at the sink area. So first, what I like to do is I like to prep my sink area because I don't want any of my supplies to become contaminated. So since we're gonna be turning the faucet on an awful lot, we're gonna put some extra paper towels there so we can just not contaminate our gloves and we can use the towel to turn it on and off. Then we're going to lay down a towel in this area to help protect our supplies. So let me be doing that and just lay it down nice and neat. And what we're gonna put on it is our toothbrush with our bristles up, our cleaning paste, some extra paper towels to dry the basin out with, our basin, of course our dentures and our denture cup and our gloves. Then we're going to prep the inside of the sink. This is really one of the most important steps you want to take when you are cleaning dentures. And what we're going to do is we're going to create this like cushion in the bottom of the sink because just in case if you drop the dentures and let me tell you from cleaning lots of dentures they become slippery and they can easily fall out of your hand. So what we're going to do is we're going to just lay these towels down in the sink and then we're going to turn on our water. But first let's pull the stopper and then just fill it up halfway with water. And again, this just provides a nice cushion just in case those dentures were to fall into the sink. Okay, and it's about halfway, so we're gonna go ahead and turn the water off. Now we're going to prep our toothbrush. And again, you wanna use like a soft bristled toothbrush or check with your patient or your supplies and see if you have a denture cleaning brush, which is specifically made for cleaning dentures. And we're going to use some cleaning paste. And I know a lot of hospitals, you may only have access to regular toothpaste. You can use that, but just keep in mind that regular toothpaste can be abrasive to the dentures if they have whiteners in them but we're gonna use a cleaning paste and we're going to put it on our toothbrush, just like how you normally would your own toothbrush at home. And put the cap back on the toothpaste. And set our brush down for a second while we get everything else prepped. Now we're ready to clean the dentures. So what we're gonna do is I'm just gonna rearrange the supplies just here a little bit that up here and put our base in here. And what we're gonna do is we're going to don our gloves because anytime you are touching dentures, you need to always wear gloves to protect you from getting any germs from the dentures because the mouth is has a lot of bacteria in it. And we're gonna turn our water on warm. We don't want it hot because it can damage the dentures. And we don't want it too cold because it really won't do the job. So we're gonna turn our water on warm 
and we're gonna get our dentures. And what we wanna do first is we're gonna rinse them off. We're gonna put them in the kidney basin because we want to clean this denture cup so we'll have a nice clean area for the dentures to be returned to. So grab your dentures and hold them firmly and then just rinse them. Put them in the kidney basin. Do the other, the other set. Rinse them off in the kidney basin. Now we're going to rinse our denture cup. And notice how dirty it gets. You wanna make sure you get all that out of there because we're going to fill it a little bit up with water, just enough water to cover the dentures. And why do we wanna do that? Well, we wanna do that so the dentures are kept moist because it'll be easier for the patient to put them back in and it'll help them keep their shape. Now you always wanna ask the patient what they use to soak their dentures in because some patients use half of a solution like half vinegar and half water or a tablet solution. So always ask them that. Now what we wanna do is we're going to start cleaning the dentures. So we're gonna get our toothbrush and we're going to start inward and work our way outward. And see rinsing helped remove a lot of that but you have to watch out because down in the gum line, you will get a lot of paste because a lot of patients use paste on their dentures and food particles. And that's just a nasty reservoir for germs and bacteria to get in. So make sure you really clean that area very good. And then looking at the front of the teeth as well, getting that because food particles like to get in there. No one wants anything in their teeth whenever they put their teeth back in. So you want them nice and clean. And then flip them over and get up where the palate part would be as well. Okay, and then we're going to rinse those. And once you get them nice and rinsed, we put them in your denture cup. Now we're going to clean our bottoms. And again, we're gonna follow the same way we did with the other ones. Clean inside that gum line really good. And make sure all the bacteria and food particles and everything's removed. Then brush on the back teeth and the front teeth, molars, just like how you would brush your natural teeth. Getting inside where the tongue would lay. And then rinse. And then return to your denture cup, which has water in it. And we'll put the lid back on the cup. Now what we're gonna do is we're going to rinse our toothbrush and our basin. Get that cleaned. And we're gonna get the toothbrush and really rub your finger, your glove finger over that toothbrush to get all the food particles out and the toothpaste out, get it nice and clean. And then I like to take a paper towel and just dry that basin out. Get that toothbrush dried as well and just put that back in there. And then turn your water off. Don't forget to pull the stopper. And let the water drain out and then we'll take our towels once all the water's drained out and put it in the linen. And we're going to doff our gloves and perform perform hand hygiene. And then when you're done, don't forget to provide oral care to your patient and assist them with putting their dentures back in if they choose to. Okay, so that wraps up how to clean dentures as a nurse. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more videos.